Welcome to Tuesdays with Tom. Well, it's October, and you know what that means, right? It's hockey season. That's right, it's hockey season, and I am really excited. I'm pumped up now. Anybody who knows me knows that I'm a huge New York Rangers fan and a, and a really, really big Dallas Stars fan. So I got a few little gifts that I want to uh, give to the division rivals of those two teams. Now, before we get on to that, I want to tell you something. First of all, I am against the Golden Knights of Las Vegas. I know everybody's jumping on the bandwagon. It's such a great story. Well, in the zero hour last year, they were unable to keep the Antichrist from touching the Stanley Cup. So I'm out. I'm hoping that they finish in last place. Now let's talk about some of the division rivals for the Rangers. Now, Rangers are going through a rebuild. Not going to be a very good team. Doesn't mean I'm not going to make fun of the rivals. Well, to the Pittsburgh Penguins, what am I going to give you? I'm going to give you a cap captain with a spine, because uh, Cindy's got none. Now, how about for the, uh, for the Philadelphia Flyers? For the Philadelphia Flyers, I have a nice big Carson Wentz doll, because that's the closest thing that you're going to get to a, to a championship in that city for a long time. Now, how about, uh, how about the uh, New York Islanders? Well... I think we should return back to the days where their logo made their fans want to chant, we want fish sticks. Or maybe that was the Rangers fans, I can't really tell. Now, how about some of the rivals for the Dallas Stars? They've got some good ones. The Colorado Avalanche. For the Colorado Avalanche, I'm wishing up for some loosening up of the laws for the, for uh, marijuana, wait, no, they've already got that, so they've pretty much got everything. You're going to need that, uh, extra marijuana up in, a, in, in avalanche country this year. How about the Predators? For the Predators, you know what I want? Prozac in your municipal water supply. You're going to need it when you're facing us Dallas Stars. And uh, how about the Wild? For the Minnesota Wild, um, it's a great team, but uh, you were named after an ice cream. So uh, how about something that's named after a real manly food, like a uh, manwich or something? You got any ideas that you want to uh, tell me about some of the rivals for the Stars and for the, for the Rangers? Let me know. Until that time, peace. Heavy metal.